Good morning, kids, and welcome back to Timberborn. We're going to continue on where we left off this beaver colony, which is just exponential growth. We got a whole lot of stuff going on, but it just needs a whole lot of work done. <laughs> All right. Well, it looks like the game actually crashed a little bit, so ah, here we go. We're going to go back to our original double speed, and with it, continue on the game. Ah, there we go. Now let's see. We do have this, so we could. Oh wait, no, we already have have uh, the gear factory being built, right? And over here we have this. We have a whole lot of stuff that needs to be built. We just need uh, resources for it, which is just well waiting on trees. Nice chestnuts go there, and roasted chestnuts go up there. Yeah, might as well go ahead and do that. I mean, you're not going to be able to do a damn thing for a long time. Now, these have only just grown. And they're still going to take like a week before they even show chestnuts. So, there won't be any chestnuts roasting on an open fire yet. <laughs> Ooh, water's flowing back through here. That can only mean... Eh, almost. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, it's time. Ha <laughs> ha. We're about to complete them. Yes! Once we have this one built, we'll have our second dam complete. Well, technically thought on how you want to count it. <laughs> yeah, it can even go over the nail. <laughs> nah. Nah. <laughs> Hmm. Ah, and there everyone goes. Off to walk. Oh, and look. They're even beginning to build this. Ooh, they're about halfway done with both. Which would mean they're about halfway done with it for 100%. Hmm. Ah, there's 40 logs needed for the Lido. Hmm, <laughs> love it. Oh, hold on, hold on. Game crashing a little. Like, it doesn't overheat my computer. It just sometimes just crashes like this. Just, well, not really crashes, but just stops for the... Oh, lags. There we go. That's what I'm looking for, it lags. Whenever it's auto-saving is when it is. Mm-hmm, <laughs> Ooh, something I just thought of is that if I copy this and put it here, well, I could do, uh, well, this again for potatoes. Yeah, alright. Let's see about it. There we go. Medium warehouse. Yep. Right in here would go regular potatoes. Right here. And then the one above, roasted potatoes. Hmm, looks like we may be a little out of room. Eh, I would have to exactly copy this. Unless I do a... Don't, no, that, even then I want to walk. Yeah, so be it. <laughs> there we go. There. And then, of course, we put right next to this grill, another grill. <laughs> there we go. And then path it up. And boom. And now we set beautiful grilled potatoes. There. Now, of course, that will still take a while to even get close to being done. But all in all. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. I just thought something that would technically be easier. <laughs> Demolish those. And then we just take this and go like that. Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah, hold on. If that's the case, then yeah, we can get rid of this as well. 
and just rotate the stems. Aha, there we go. Ooh, no, no, let's leave that open and put a shrub there. Hmm, put a lantern or a shrub? A lantern or a shrub? Uh, you know what? Shrub. There we go. That's gonna look good. Haha, <laughs> success! Now, of course, we need to actually plant potatoes. Oh, look! They've done it! They finally built the second warehouse! Amazing! I mean, the farmhouse. Alright, go over the crops, let's get potatoes, and do that. Mm, yeah. Boom. Potato time! <laughs> good, good. We're almost done with our second windmill. Damn, looks like they haven't been finished that fast. Oh, uh, look at them beavers go! <laughs> and it's all planted. Oh yeah. Oh, and there it is! Our second windmill. Perfect! Ah, now look at that towel. <laughs> Power! <laughs> good, good. Oh, wow, they're building this now. They are just shoving wood into that. Damn. And our wood actually is going up. Hmm. I guess we have a lot of trees being cut. We, yeah, we got oaks being cut. Along with some maple. <laughs> oh, and there it is. Our dam is complete. Hmm. Now I think we don't need this path in here. <laughs> there we go. Huh. Ah, uh, this is beautiful. And why am I getting a weird sense of deja vu? Meh, I'm gonna just play it off. <laughs> Look at this, this almost have I have the logs it needs. Sweet. Maybe it's time to start work on the third floor of Beaver Tower A. <laughs> so of course we hit F to flip and then R to rotate. And now we build the stairs up to it. <laughs> this uh, angle is a little awkward. There we go. And path. Oh yeah. Now of course pause that because we don't need them building the house and then uh, and us getting that annoying notification saying, and the building is unconnected. Ugh. Hate it when we get that. It's constant. Oh, and here we go! The Lido is built! Yes! Finally! These beavers have a place to gather and swim. Now, isn't that just lovely? To celebrate the kids' first swim, we will throw a pool party. Oh look, we actually got someone in it. The first guest is Benji or Bungie. Bungie? I'm just I'm just gonna say Bungie. Congrat. Mm, excuse me. Congratulations to Bungie on being the first beaver. Oh, and look at this. They're getting to walk. I should probably still have that pause, considering that, uh, the whole... <laughs> it's still gonna be a while before we have chestnuts. <laughs> oh, wow, it's almost been four days, actually. Huh. Oh, look at all those pine trees! We're gonna have wood forever! <laughs> yes! 
just for that, I'm actually gonna go ahead and build uh, the entire third floor. Now we'll still flip to uh, this way, right? Yep. So we'll go ahead and put U, hit F, and put these other ones. <laughs> Dr. Zeus, Dr. Zeus. Dr. Zeus, Dr. Zeus. Oh, oh, Dr. Zeus. Sorry, I don't know why that was going on through my brain. And now we grab a two, and here we go. Come on now. You need to go right there. Come on. There we go. <laughs> there. Huh, wonder why this one didn't go down. Top view, if you don't mind, and there. And click, there. Build the third floor however y'all want. As long as you follow the blueprints. Oh, look! They got the grill built! Hoo-hoo! <laughs> Of course, we don't have anyone walking that one. Of course, we probably won't for a while, because we need chestnuts. And those are still, like, three days away. <laughs> uh, but we're gonna get so much wood, we may actually have a use of our stockpile again. Oh, look! They even built the shrub! Yes! <laughs> What's next? Are they building this? No, they were building the shrub. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I'll go ahead and put our next windmill there. There we go. Oh, look at this. Yeah, how's that for popular? <laughs> Nearly full capacity. Oh, max capacity. Eh, both max, uh, interchangeable, really. Oh, this is great. <laughs> and it's a perfect fit as well. Now, as long as we don't get, uh, as long as we don't get any bad tide, we should be fine. Because you know, if we get a bad tide, the beetles will. Well, we don't know actually. From what I've seen, it seems like a bad tide will destroy any platforms or. Maybe even stales that get in the way. It's hard to tell. Hmm. Maybe it's time to start looking into building a bridge. Just replacing our way across. Yes, I think it is time. Though, of course, I think they may also need metal, I'm not sure. I'll have to check in a moment once the game's done crashing. Or auto save, or whatever it is. Probably both. <laughs> 21, and I mean the 24 beavers. Not for long. We're building an additional 4 rooms with 3 beavers each. That's an additional 12 of 36. Now let's see. They should be over here. Ah, do they need metal? No, they don't. Okay, the the four one. Yeah. Looks like when you get the four space one, that's when you're gonna need the you know, metal. Otherwise, you just need this. Hmm. Yeah, other than using it for like uh, additional support. <laughs> Let's see, looks like right there... Hmm, actually, yeah, using the, the uh, three across one, we could actually do it. And right there is a space... Oh, no, no, we would need, you know, 
Yeah, because if you look at it, and, uh, we would actually need a, you know, a full one if we built it here. So maybe we don't. If we build it right here, all we need is a three and a two. If we build it here, all we need is just two threes. If we build it here, we would need a three and a four. Because unfortunately, it, well, eh, it wouldn't reach. I wish we could technically, yeah, is it like, place them down to see before actually buying it. Or, oh, well, unlocking it. Plus, if we remove the stairs, we'd be stuck. So I guess you have to figure out where you want to put the bridge and then replace them. Oh, and they even built the shrub. That's perfect. So next should be all this stuff. Oh, look. Nice. Hmm. Okay. You know what? Maybe we'll build it here. Because all we need is a three and a two. Yes. And give me that two. Oh, hold on. You can use a shift all. Okay, uh, I guess you can't. Oh, yeah, you can, right there. It says right now, shift all. Oh, too far. Damn it, I hit the wrong button again. There we go. So now we actually know where we're gonna put it a three and a two. And that way, the bees will never touch the water, and we don't have to worry about a bad tide. Only thing that kind of sucks a little is, well, actually not much. It's all pretty okay. <laughs> yeah, we'll take down that berry bush and replace it with a path, and then boom, we'll have a bridge across. Looks like the pieces you would also need increase by about 10 each time. So it will take a while, but we'll still be able to get it. And I think this will actually look good. Hmm. Let's see. Oop, no, storage. Small tank is. Oh, that's a basic. Might as well put it over there. <laughs> yeah, because this one is going to replace these three. Yeah, so we might as well put one over here to at least complete that. Oh, and look, they built the rooftop turrets. It's great. <laughs> just, yeah, expo exponential growth. We're getting a lot of stuff built. <laughs> you know what? Because these beavers are doing so good, I'm going to increase the priority of Beaver Tower. Ooh, what the hell was that? Okay, there we go. <laughs> uh, there we go, I think. Oh, well, look at that. They're already about to build the boss house. Yeah, you also want to go get the planks, because you'll be able to build it even faster if you get the planks. Go get the planks. Oh, we've gotten a lot done and it's only been 20 minutes. Not bad. Looks like these chestnut trees are about ready to produce. I give it another day or two. Oh, and then we'll be having chestnuts. And that will be chestnuts to roast on an open file. <laughs> nah, it's not going to be an open file. Well, we don't really have any other store though. We should get that done.
Yeah, there we go. We do need a place to store the cooked ones, but screw it. Just increase the probability of everything over here. There we go. Oh, and here they go. <laughs> Look at those beavers walk. Are they already building it? Ah, uh, almost. Oh, but I love this. <laughs> Looking over here. Ooh, beavers do with the broken tooth. Sorry to see that, buddy. But hey, at least your master made those deep rhinestones for you guys. Oh look, we actually have some wood in storage. Yay! Ah, looks like we'll be harvesting from these chestnuts by the end of the day. Mm-hmm. Chestnuts. And over here. Chestnuts. There you go. And of course we'll mark these ones to be just berries. Because that's all they really need. <laughs> ah, this is good. This is explosive growth. Ah, oh, there it is! We now have the place to store our chestnuts! What's next? This one? Should be. No, is it the platform? Yes, it's the platform. <laughs> it's still gonna be a while before they can get that. But oh, we're getting just so much stuff. Yes, I tell you, yes! Can we actually get this built? Because we kind of need gills. Ah, uh, look at that. I used the other rooftop tenants as well. Oh, I didn't even realize, we got the second campfire up. Ooh! We may actually be able to unlock the iron teeth, finally. Hold on for a moment, everyone. I'll be right back. And we're back. Let's continue on and where we left off. Okay, and the game is uh, auto-crashing again. <laughs> Man, this gets really annoying. Hmm. I mean, I literally tried to fix this before I even uh, hit the play button again. Yeah, but I guess it can't be helped, can it? <laughs> no, no, it cannot. <laughs> okay, there we go. It's always difficult. I don't know why it is. It's always difficult. And there it goes again! Jeez. Beetle's belly hot at all. It's running perfectly fine. Game. Just too much, I guess. <laughs> there we are. We'll get this built. <laughs> ah, and they even built the land on. Huh. Let's see, we got 22 logs. What will be next? Oh, this is built. That's nice. Well, almost built. <laughs> we got plenty of logs, so we should be able to get everything built. Ah, oh, look at this. Ha <laughs> ha! Seven more of both. Mm, now look, it would be great if we could get that built, because the only source we have is what's in here. And that is not enough. Six logs, people. Come on. That's all we need. Six logs. Get to it. And built. Finally, we have Gil. Not a lot of people. Oh, beavles, excuse me. So yeah, we do need to get these uh, homes built fast. Yes, here we go. One more, and 
boom! Now we have Link Story. That's perfect. So now these guys can unload and actually make more planks if needed. Hmm. You know, that should actually be something. This would be a thing where you can only you only make what you need to make. Otherwise, you don't make at all. I guess maybe that'd be a bit too much to program. Yeah, so I guess maybe it is just better to stick with the programming of of make until you can't. Like, fill up the space. Just go. Do it. Build. Ah. Love it. And now, all this can be put into storage. Haha. -ha. Now look at that. We already have board in there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Plank Soul just think it jumped up to 180. Oh, no, wait, that's just how many it can hold. Yeah, so 180 plus 26 for 206. Not, not bad. Ah, and look at those potatoes. This, uh, this grill is gonna be popular. <laughs> Oh, well, are they building this? Nope, they must be building that. Ah, lovely. Oh, look, they're going for Midnight Swim. Hmm. Something I could do is build a second... Now, this bad water comes from up here. And it's the closest one. So yeah, if we were to build on a town district hill, that would give us reach over to hill. All we would have to do is bridge across this, and then we'd be able to get up to hill. A bad water source. Hmm. I wonder if there's then a way to clean up the contamination. <laughs> But still, though, that would be great. We get out that bad water, we then go up to... Somewhere up here. There it is. And we get the clean water to flow in. Hmm. Technically, yeah, we could get a two-four. Ooh, no, 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 hold on, hold on. We can actually get this. Wait, is that down one? Yes, that's actually down one. We'd have to build stairs down. Oh boy. <laughs> eh. Maybe we will, maybe we won't. Huh. That's strange. Where were you getting water from? Hmm. You know what? Let's do it. We will need to go across the dam. That is a lot of trees. Holy moly. We're never going to have to worry about wood again. You see why it was so wise to plant all those oak and maple? We literally have wood forever. <laughs> and once we can get all of this wood. Oh yeah. It's all coming together. Maybe it is time to put a second district up. Yeah, if we cleared out here, we could actually use this as, as the place for the next beaver. What? Oh, it's just blueberries. Next beaver tower. You know what? I'm calling it. For the end of this episode, it's time to build our second district. Rotate, of course. And build. Second district. Now a district crossing, is that can that be on the water? Whoa. Uh no, no it cannot. Oh wait, no, that's because I'll pass now. But yeah, probably still can't be on the water. Hmm. Damn. You know, they gonna make it well instead of building a whole new district center, you could instead expand the control. Like make a a sub center. 
So like you have this one, the main district central, but then you can build a smaller one that that's not as strong somewhere else. Like all it would just be would like be like a waypoint, a way of extending the control of the other one. Instead of having to build a whole new district. So, it won't be too long. You know what? For well, the end of this episode, oh, no, we're we'll actually out of time. Well then, folks, looks like that's going to be the end of today's episode. I hope you all enjoyed this. Just remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more. Uh, and I was about to say link, and there is no link. Uh, thank you all for watching, and I'll see all of you kids next time when we flick on. Peace out.